Well, hello everyone. Welcome back to. Sorry, Sonan, I was doing the intro. Welcome back to Playframe and Final Fantasy VII Intermission: The Yuffie Story. And now that we've got now that we've got her in like her classic Yuffie look and gear and such, I'm kind of wanting to like take in the costuming because there is so much about Yuffie's design that sort of baffled me, <laughs> uh, costuming wise from the original. And I like this. Uh, I like this incarnation. I love that the right glove has a very classic. Uh, like samurai armor, shinobi, sort of like uh, just that that armor on the right arm is great. This thing sleeve on the left arm is confusing. <laughs> I've always wondered what this was like a reference to. I feel like it's got to be some classic piece of armor or protective gear or something. And that open like slot in the right there, like that looks like a slot for materia or for something to go there, like maybe her shuriken. Has she been using that in combat and I've just not noticed? I don't know. I love the little yellow. I can't remember if the little yellow uh, dangling cloth there from the shoulder piece was also part of her original costuming look, but she looks great. I love how she looks in this game. Let's go. There's no more. Please tell me there's no more board game opponents. <laughs> Listen, I've got a ninja mission. Tabletop is fun and all, but I've got a job to do. Eh. Excuse me, everyone. Out of my way. I have a secret ninja mission to destroy this entire city. Don't tell anyone. Don't tell anyone that I haven't told already during my board gaming. Hi, Rush. <laughs> what? <laughs> Hold on. This I must... What, are you scared of me? I have to know what that was in reference to. All right, fine. All right, well, they're all very impressed with Roche. And the kid's apparently very scared of me, so fine, whatever, I'm leaving. So, you think Kyle and the others got away? We can worry about that once we have lost. Good point. We were in desperate need of some voice of reason in this group. Boss. I don't think we'll be back here anytime soon, so make sure you're ready for anything, okay? I am ready for anything. Trust me, I am already Grand Master Champion of Fort Condor. Sorry, I know that's unrelated to our mission. I've got a lot of explaining to do. I think we're good here. Let's roll. Due to the recent incident at Mako Reactor 5, only a limited number of trains are currently in service. Please note that the Sector 5 Undercity Station is closed until further notice. Hmm. Shh. Splinter Cell's done its best to make things hard for you. Miss this train and there's no telling when the next will be. Looks like it's now or never, guys. Sorry we couldn't give you a proper send-off. Just know that we're rooting for you, okay? All aboard! Pardon me, Master of Stealth. Coming through. Everyone, please, I'm a ninja. Uh, oh, boy. It's gonna be sick. She always did get motion sick. I'll be fine. As long as I'm standing up. Ugh. Don't laugh. Melfi always got motion sick. Chocobos, boats. I'm sure trains would have done it too. Who is Melfi? My sister. She trained under your father at the same time as me. And she had such promise. Had? The war was ending. But a Shinra mech went haywire near a crowd, and she had to do something. Wait 
deserve what's coming to him. Yeah. They do. But I'm not your sister. <laughs> Chapter 2. Are we on schedule? <laughs> the Turks are on top of it. Yes, there will be no delays. Please, Mr. President. I am asking you to reconsider. No, begging. The Sector 7 Undercity is home to more than 50,000. <sighs> Director Tuesty. At least let us issue a warning, sir. The stench of the director's cowardice fills the room yet again. <laughs> Breathe. Progress requires sacrifice. Learn to live with it. Well, we just walked right in, huh? Whoa, look at all these people. Enough to make you sick. Let's get this over with. <laughs> Excuse me, I have some questions. You work for Shinra, isn't that right? <laughs> then would you care to comment on the rumors that Sector 7 will be the dearest next target? <laughs> They're going to hit the reactor, aren't they? You! Stop right there! Get the hell what out of here. Right Elevators are right there. Let's catch one. Okay. You're up, Heidi. Come on, come on, come on. Hold the door. Oh, no. What floor? The basement. Advanced weaponry. Going down. Door closing. Play it cool. Subtle. Perfect. Just perfect. Hmm? Huh? Uh. <sighs> but oh, how the mighty are fallen. Wu Tai colluding with Avalanche and resorting to terrorism? <laughs> I always thought the Wu Taians an honorable people. They used to be, certainly. But now, now they're nothing but blood sucking flies buzzing around Shinra's face. <laughs> Calm. Would you not agree? In light of recent events, I mean. I would. Hundred <laughs> percent. What a lovely smile. Uh. Open up! I think not. Foreign visitors should take the scenic route and savor the opportunity to meet our latest autonomous weapons. We're very bad ninjas. Damn it. I'll never get a better chance. That was Scarlet, director of advanced weaponry. It was one of her machines that killed Melfi. Calm down, Sonon. Calm down. Remember. We're here for a reason. Right, boss. I'm sorry. Don't be. I was ready to strangle her myself. And that's before she sent us off in the wrong direction. Where did she send us? <laughs> Only one way to find out. 
Don't worry, we'll get to materia research eventually. Just a little longer, my precious. All right, to work. So, um... Ooh, bench! Don't need it, but I want it. Ah, see, got to take a nice rest every now and then, Sonon. So, what do we have here? Anything good? Hmm, nothing new, it looks like. All right. I feel more or less equipped. Charge! Ooh, what's this? Can I go in? No? Okay. What's this now? Breakable. Just look at this place. Weapons here, weapons there, weapons everywhere. They're ready for some serious action. It sounds like you are too. Duh. Unlike my old man, I'm not some lazy drunk. I fight for what I believe in. Something he'd never understand. I wonder how he's holding Kind bars, you mean? Not well, if the government's got anything to say about it. Good on him. Jail's where he belongs. That's my master you're talking about. Winding off in a little... You know what? That's strong. Not exactly my favorite talk. It's only gonna make me mad. More importantly... My god, you people are deadly boring. What? There were crates. Luckily, I know exactly how to line things up. We have a little experiment. Just don't go dying on me. That might give you a very interesting results now, would it? Um. Um. Oh no. Okay. <laughs> All right. Yeah. So I've learned a few new things about combat, which is not to say that I'm going to be any better at it. Especially now that I, it's been a week since I recorded anything. <laughs> but, uh, I watched a handy guide on how to take a little better advantage of some of uh, Yuffie's tricks. Or at least, I have a better understanding of what Yuffie's capable of. I'm willing to bet that I'm going to complete this DLC before I have managed <laughs> to actually use any of it. Ow. Uh, let's see. Let's see here. Uh, Sonan, go do something. So apparently, while I've got a nice little pause here, Yuffie's aerial game is incredible, and uh, I need to be making more use of Windstorm. Not uh, just willy-nilly, but when her shuriken is, like, already spinning and attacking a target, because it really does apparently huge damage to that target. And also, when I'm using, what's the uh, ability? Uh, Art of War, I need to use it synergized, because uh, apparently that's a big damage dealer. Heck, let's try that now. On the sweeper. Oh, it really pressures him, too. Oh, yeah. Good damage, good pressuring. The guide was right. By the, So the guides that I use when trying to learn how to better control these characters... I'll say it in a minute. Maybe I should top off. <laughs> Actually, while we have a chance here, let's, um, all right, fine, never mind. Uh, so the, the guides I've been using are, I believe the YouTube, uh, channel is called Blizz? So I'll link up to the, uh, the Yuffie guide in the top corner in a second. Actually, here, the guide's up there right now. What? There's more? Uh, he's made guides for basically all of the playable Final Fantasy VII Remake characters, uh, explaining how to kind of make best use of all their various abilities and kit. It's super helpful, and it really reveals just how much depth there is to the combat for every character in the game. It's pretty impressive. So here's one thing that I should be taking more advantage of on aerial enemies. This. <laughs> because you can, uh... <laughs> you can use, uh, that throw shuriken and then retrieve shuriken, or rather, go to wherever the shuriken is to just dash right up to aerial enemies. And apparently, if you kind of keep doing that with her uh, basic attack, you can just stay airborne forever. <laughs> I 
I've clearly not mastered it, but it's a cool thing you can do if you're actually good at the video game. Anyway, um... So then you need to be learning this ability, I think, so use it on that. Go nuts. And help me out, will you? Very good. Ow, uh... Beat it up! Get up there in the air. Ugh. Stop being shocked. <laughs> so, Anon, do you think you could maybe, I don't know, save us? Thank you. Get it. All right, stay airborne. Keep staying airborne. Yes. See, this is what I'm talking about. <laughs> no other character in the game can do that. <laughs> it's very good. There's a lot that Yuffie can do that other characters can't do. Like, and the guide really helps me to recognize that. And it's very cool. Credit where credit is due. You exceeded my every expectation. And for being such good sports, you may now leave. Ooh. Why did I ever think for a second she'd be nice to us? She knows damn well it's gonna be a pain in the ass getting up there. She sure does. I guarantee that, despite this newfound knowledge I have, I am going to finish this short DLC without even reaching, like, 70 or 80% <laughs> uh, skill level on taking full advantage of Yuffie's kit. It's cool to know, though. And maybe by the time we get to, uh, <laughs> remake part two. Honestly, how do I do it? Now then, Sonon, how you feel about giving me a boost? Ecstatic. I love your enthusiasm. But yeah, by the time we get to part two, maybe, maybe by then, I'll have gotten more good. Okay, get to climbing. One can dream. Anything else over here? No? Cool. Do we need to top off? I bet we do. Yeah, we could stand a little top off. Do... Oh, you can't do prayer outside of battle, can you? That's fine. Thank you. Forward. Madam Director, the intruders are about to reach the research facility. And we'll let them. Meanwhile, find out what it is they want. <laughs> you do have eyes, don't you? Then you can see that while they are simpletons, they've made it further than any normal Wu Taiyan ever could. It's impressive. Clearly, they are ninjas. Clearly. <laughs> Teenage ninjas. <laughs> and they've come such a long way. We simply must roll out the red carpet. My trusty steed should provide a fitting welcome, I think. Keep me apprised, would you? Ma'am, cut system power to the research facility. Bar access to confidential data, then retrace their steps. Find out why they're here. Above all, do not let them out of your sight. Sir! Oh, Materia, where are you? Scarlet, you're overthinking this. Literally all you have to do to stop me in my tracks is send someone to challenge me to a tabletop match. It's proven 100% effective so far. Nope. Enemies. <laughs> Alright, so let me charge up. Okay, cool. Let me test out this Windstorm thing. So, if I just use Windstorm regularly, it does that. Which is cool, and it draws enemies toward me, and it does some damage to them. It's not bad, but uh, I've learned, never use it like that. <laughs> That's not the way to do it. Stop it. Stop. Quit. Stop. I'm trying to demonstrate a thing. If I hit you with this, though, and then do Windstorm... <laughs> Way better. This their idea of mood lighting? Cause it's bad. Might be the power. That thing's off too. I love the amount of complexity just to her basic attacks. The fact that they function completely differently. Uh, whether you're tapping square, holding square down, and whether or not your target is, uh, is currently like being hit by your shuriken. There's a lot of depths to how she controls, and it's really cool. Talk about the jackpot. This must be where they make their 
cafeteria. Maybe, but they're not what we came for. Let's keep moving. Close. Totally. After I grab a few souvenirs. Imagine how cool this would all look if I was competent at it. Give. But I want it. <laughs> Alright, we need to turn on the power. I want to steal everything. Gotcha. Power button. Where are you? Hey. Here we are. Eh, it's not over here, is it? Nope. Ooh, power button. Level one power grid online. Yes. Theft. Initiating Mako energy saturation. Deploying security grid. Deploying what? Mine. Ninja Cannonball? I beg your pardon, what are you talking about? Ninja Cannonball? What is the- okay. Uh, allows you to perform Ninja Cannonball with R1 and Triangle while synergized. Fills Sonon's ATB gauge when the attack connects. Cool. Okay. Yeah. Let's try it. Do I need to equip it on me or him? Uh, I guess either, right? Hmm. Let's do that, but then... Is there anything he doesn't need? I don't know how much Provoke is doing for me. I guess it's probably saving me when things get a little dicey. Now, you know what? I'm doing fine on MP for the moment. Let's, uh, ah, you know, no, I'll keep it. I'm not using steel at all, <laughs> which is maybe stupid, but whatever. Let's, uh, let's just put it on Yuffie and try it out while we look for more things to steal. So R1 and triangle. Okay. Yes. Mine. Steadfast block. All right. Never hurts to have one more of those. And what's this last one? Skill Master. Huh. Okay. What is this one? Uh, Skill Master. Slightly fills the ATB gauge when multiple ATB commands are performed. Huh, so like just sort of back to back? Small ATB gauge increase when using three types of commands. Huh. Is that just using a variety of things in close proximity, or...? Okay, so yeah, like every time I use three different kinds of commands, maybe it gives me a slight ATB gauge boost, so it encourages me to use a variety of skills instead of just a small set. Interesting. Next time I get an open slot, I'll try equipping that one. That seems neat. Speaking of, I don't suppose... Yeah, we could upgrade the weapons a little bit. Yeah, okay. Could probably get at least one thing. Probably not a materia slot, but maybe. Um... Let's see. Uh, ba -ba -bum. Weapon ability critical hit rate boost 10% seems pretty good. Eh, let's do it. Hey, we can get two things, why not? And let's do magic attack power up because it seems like a lot of her best stuff is magical in nature. Yeah. Even if I'm not having to use like elemental magic materia to do it, which is really cool. Very unique. Um, okay. Sonan, your turn. More materia, perhaps? Maybe? Yes! Oh, it just connected some. Okay. Well, still good. Um... Hmm. 
Let's give you damage reduction while guarding, since I'm kind of wanting you to be a tank. Uh, enhanced physical. Here we go. Nice. All right, cool. On with the show. Man, this remake is fun. Where am I going? Is it this way? I want to say it's this way. Hey. Oh, not in the mood, huh? Fine. We'll find another way up. Darn right we will. What can I break? I know I can throw my shuriken at something. Do I need to shut this back off? No, can't. Okay. Um, all right, that looks climbable. That that fan. Can I get there? Wait. Okay, yes, if I can get on that platform there. And I can jump to it. Okay, okay, okay. The prompt was just blending in a little bit. Is that a security grate or a ladder? Thanks, Shinra. Doop, 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 doop. There we go. That's weird. Not even a whip of materia up here. Boo. Then there's nowhere else to go. Hmm. Ooh, ribbon. Ribbons are usually good. I can't remember what they do in this game, though. Uh, ribbon. Prevents detrimental status effects. Okay, so the same thing. Uh, harder to be interrupted while casting magic. Also good. Maybe that should go on him? Maybe. What's he got right now? Kindred cord. Uh, reduces ATP cost for synergized abilities. Does that work on him? Or does that have to be on me? Because I can't remember. I don't think, like, synergized abilities cost anything for him, do they? I'll have to check next time I use a synergized ability to see if it, like, takes his ATB as well. Hmm. I'll keep an eye out. If it doesn't, I'll just put the ribbon on him, because the current thing in that case is doing nothing. What else is over here? Boom. Uh, looks like nothing. Let's go this way. Um, can we get to the other fan? I bet we can. Yeah, here we go. This is better, probably. Maybe. Maybe. Come on. Directions are finicky. Hmm, we're back here. But maybe this works now? Probably not, right? No, wait, hang on. Uh, I see an objective marker somewhere. Map, are you going to be any help? No. <laughs> Seems like no. Yeah, I figured. Okay. Time to look around. I guess this is a door-looking thing I kind of ignored before. Oh, there we go. All right. Mistook it for a wall. Getting lots of good stuff. Seems like. What does that one do? Uh, oh. Uh, oh, it's an armlet. Okay. And not a very good one, though. Oh, it triples. Okay, so it's like triple AP gain, but you can barely equip anything, so... Not right now. Hmm. Okay. Dudes. I should probably use Assess, huh? Eh. Alright, let's use Assess before we get hit. There we go. Okay. Weak to fire. Good to know. But I do not care for I'm going to hit you with wind when I get a chance. So I'm going to do something. Uh, use your fighting spirit. You still need to keep training that up. Hit that guy. I will also hit that guy when I get a chance. Excuse me. 
Hey! Trying to do a thing. Boom! There you go. See, that's better. Vacuum wave, huh? Don't love it. I'm doing poorly because I'm wanting to, like, try out all my abilities. <laughs> Instead of focus on actually fighting effectively. See, I need to be using, like, my dodges and such. Like, so. So that's what you're supposed to do. Smart things. Let's, uh, go ahead and... that. Get hit a bunch. Yeah, oh gosh. That windstorm is very strong. Boom. So good. I think so. Increasingly, the more I learn how to use you. What else have we got here? Anything interesting? Hmm. Should probably top off, huh? Oh, yeah. Let's do that thing. Uh, here we go. Oop. There we go. Yay. Come on. Jump. Oh dear. That looks dangerous. Let's fight it. Immune to regular magic, but I bet not to lightning. Let's, um, well, let's assess and find out. Oh, a core. It's got a core. Okay, so, oh, weak to nothing. Uh, while their core is exposed, they'll unleash a powerful pulse laser. Destroying or stealing the core will weaken and render them susceptible to staggering. Oh, I bet I could steal the core. Cool. Gosh. I, well, I think I unequipped steal, so... Alas. But, um... <laughs> let's target the core then, huh? Uh... Targeting core now, I think. I think. Am I? Maybe I can't target the core individually. Look out. Uh, someone undo something. And then help me with this. Now, I hurt a lot. I ran out of ATB so fast. Uh, let's see. Great, please. All right, you're, to, you're as like a core now. Do I need to uh, assess you again? I'm gonna do it just in case, because I wonder if it shows weakness now, because I'm guessing the weakness is lightning. Oh, enhanced magic trooper. Oh, you're just a, like a regular enhanced magic trooper now. Can I? Oh, I haven't assessed you anyway. Let's do it. All right. Oh, it's still weak to nothing. Fire and magic attacks rapidly fill stagger gauge, though. Good to know. Doesn't matter. <laughs> We're the best. The best there ever was. Gotcha. All right. Let's break and steal more stuff. Ooh. Here's the thing. A gin staff. I really need... How are you doing on fighting spirit, by the way? I've been trying to use it, but I don't feel like... I think you only gain proficiency when... Yeah, when you kill an enemy using it. So, continue targeting a single damage uh, enemy to deal increased damage. So... We we'll use this to focus down enemies who are, like, on their last legs. And then we'll get you switched to this. To learn Incite, draw the attention of a weak foe until Yuffie deals with a certain amount of damage. Neat. Okay. Soon. Um, is this the same room? Looks like the same room. Be good. 
Let's find out. Is it good? Ooh, goodness, look at all this stuff. I I want to take it. Can I... Eh. Dang it. It taunts me. Employee identity confirmed. Really? Access granted. Occupancy limited to one subject. Proceed to gate to begin training exercise. What? Training? Really? Just give us what we came for already. Might still be worth a shot. Could be something in it for us. Just be careful. Okay? Oh, there's training exercises. Okay. And we can do them to get an orb of assist materia, boost materia, and stagger. I don't know if I'll do all this now or on camera. <laughs> but, uh, neat. Training is not a bad thing for me. Let's try it before we wrap up. Oh, this is not what I expected. Uh, like with its Sector 5 Undercity relative, the objective is to destroy as many boxes as possible within the time limit. Each box will add to your score, and when the timer reaches zero, the training exercises is over. Reach the target score to win. The durability, effects, and score differ with each type of box. Okay. Uh, all right. I figured out how to do this with Cloud reasonably well. It'll probably take a little practice using Yuffie. Uh, this training exercise contains two unique types of crates, each with their own weaknesses. Orange crates, with the image of a sword, are more susceptible to physical damage, while the purple crates, featuring a wand, are more susceptible to magic and ninjutsu. Okay. Destroying red boxes extends your time. Great. All right, cool. Well, let's um, try this out. Let me add them. I wonder if there's a specific shuriken that's best for these. Break stuff. Good. Okay, so this. Hit him with these. There we go. Cool. Awesome. Okay. Uh, where's the rest? Ah, here we go. What about these? What are what are these weak to? Anything? Anything specific? That'll do it. <laughs> there we go. Yeah, okay. Boom! Break already! Stop being so strong! Break stuff, break stuff, break stuff, break stuff! That's what I should be doing for these big clusters. Get over there! Break them! There we go, alright. Still getting the feel of controls. <laughs> or like using them to maximum effect. There we go. Okay. Get in there. Try this out. Does this work well? Yeah, that one works pretty well for breaking it fast. Okay. Run. I've beaten the target score, so that's nice. Nice. Alright. Got more time. Awesome. Uh-oh. Whiff. Uh... Jump! No. There we go. Good enough. All right. What are you? What are you even targeting? Oh. Quickly. Oh, is there another? Uh... I don't think I'm gonna hit a time thing, but we did definitely score well. I'll take that. Nice. Okay, you know, I'll do another one. Now, I tell you what, we'll, we'll do the other two tomorrow, all right? Sound good? Take it easy, everybody, and I will see you tomorrow for more of that nonsense. Goodbye!